What's a good way to recognize the equilibrium line source and equilibrium line sink in a first order linear system? The transitions sink to saddle and source to saddle in the trace determinant plane, they happen on the t axis where the d is zero, where the determinant is zero. What is a good visual way to recognize the matrix of such a system? We've already discussed that in a two by two matrix, the determinant is zero only when the rows are multiples of each other and that's pretty easy to spot as long as you're not fooled by a minus sign for example I've already written down these four matrices with their trace and determinant so you can see which is which but do you see in the first example both these rows are multiples of minus one two or you could say multiples of one two with one negative sign thrown in the trace is minus seven the determinant is zero this makes it an equilibrium line case, and since the trace is minus 7, it's on the sink side, the equilibrium line sink. The second matrix, it almost looks like the rows are multiples of each other, but watch that sign. These rows are not multiples of each other, and the determinant here is minus 12, minus 12, negative 24. So you know exactly what that system is. It's not an equilibrium line source or sink. Next example, 2 minus 6. There are 2, 6, and minus 3, minus 9. Those are both multiples of 1, 3. Trace is minus 7 again, and determinant is 0. This is an equilibrium line sink. This last matrix, 4, 1, negative 8, minus 2. Second row is negative 4, or excuse me, negative 2 times the first row. So they're multiples of each other. You see the trace is 2, and the determinant is 0. This is on the source side. This is an equilibrium line source. The equilibrium line case is when the two rows are multiples of each other.